The Me Too movement has forced a cultural reckoning around the issue of sexual violence and harassment against women in America. Are there specific actions that you would take early in your administration to address this problem? Yes, and by the way, it's one of the reasons, the first thing I would do is make sure we pass the Violence Against Women Act reauthorization, which I wrote. The fact, I didn't write the reauthorization, I wrote the original act. The fact is that what happens now is that we in fact have to fundamentally change the culture, the culture of how women are treated. That's why as vice president, when I asked the president I could start the, the movement on the college campuses to say it's on us. It's everyone's responsibility. We do not spend nearly enough time dealing with, I was stunned when I did a virtual town meeting that told me 30,000 people were on the, on the call, young people between 15 and 25, and found out, I said, what do you need, what do you need to make you safer on college campuses and on your schools? You know what they said? Get men involved. Engage the rest of the community. And that's when we started this movement on the college campuses to fundamentally change the culture. No man has a right to raise a hand to a woman in anger other than in self-defense and that's rarely ever occurs and so we have to just change the culture period and keep punching at it and punching at it and punching at it it will be a big pr no i really mean it it, it make it, it's a gigantic issue and we have to make it clear from the top from the president on down that we will not tolerate it we will not tolerate this culture